The enemy's close. Did you hear Alpha? Time to swap ships, partner. To be honest, I wanted to be the one to capture the Volgus commander. How infuriating. The operation to retrieve the Ironheart failed, and I got injured. Ugh. That leaves a bad taste in my mouth. I should go swap out my weapons and upgrade my modules if I don't want to be defeated again. Guess I'll head back first. Good luck! See you in Albion! data transmitter, please destroy it. At that range, I'll be able to intercept the transmission and secure the data. It's imperative we prevent the ancestor's data from falling into Corral's hands. Ancestor's data packets detected. Transmission is taking place close by. We will all be at risk if you do not stop them. Hurry! You should be able to see the data transmitter shortly. I'll prepare myself.
Data packet collection. 90% complete. Descendant. I'll look for the final data transmitter. Wait. The location is... <laughs> Transmission is almost complete. To all descendants, I have obtained the Ancestor's data. With this, I have been able to restore my system. If there are any descendants who can speak to me now, please connect. I would like to speak with you directly. I have vital information. This is Enzo, standing by to upload records to the command console. If there are any descendants able to respond, 
Please speak to the guide. Descendant, thanks to you the data was located, and I was able to restore my functions. Should my system be damaged again, bringing me into contact with another Ironheart is a fail-safe restoration method. However, should this prove to be impossible, there is an emergency restoration protocol put in place by the Ancestors. By collecting particle elements from where the Ironheart was excavated, a similar contact environment can be created. This protocol can also be applied, should the Iron Heart be damaged. The Volgus wanted to secure the Ancestor's data to obtain this information. When I was separated from the Iron Heart, the Iron Heart that the Volgus seized was also damaged. The void erosions in the ruins likely occurred due to this damage. And descendant, there is something else that concerns me. How did the Vargas know that the Ancestors' facility had this information? The only entities that I can think of who would consider using the system restoration protocol are guides and Ancestors. Unless... Unless there is an Ancestor among the Vargas. Wait. Descendant, I can sense vibrations. They feel very similar to avoid erosion, threatening. Void dimension link detected. Colossus is approaching. I repeat, void dimension link detected. But Colossus is approaching. Classification type Great War. All descendants and Alpha, prepare for intercept battle. Damn it! Why a Colossus now, of all the times? All personnel, prepare for an intercept battle. Deployable personnel. Make your way to Seneca immediately, and head to the Void.
about the Colossus descendant. Ever since Corral caused the void erosion with the Iron Heart, the Colossi have become more active. According to my calculations, the expected point of arrival for this Colossus is at the Kingston border. The classification type is Grave Walker, just like the one you encountered at the ruins. That specimen was weaker due to the unexpected nature of the dimensional link. But things will be different this time. If this Colossus manages to enter Ingress, Kingston may be lost to us forever. We must intercept it in the Void Dimension before that happens. I will send you to the Void Dimension once you have finished your battle preparations. May the intercept be successful, Descendant.
the space and fabric of the void is extremely large. Good work, Descendant. The Colossus was stronger than average, and you still achieved a resounding victory. However, as long as the dimensional wall remains open, the invasion of the Colossi will never end. Until the dimensional wall is closed, humankind will have no choice but to live with the fear of the Colossi. Descendant, securing the Iron Hearth and closing the dimensional wall, it isn't just to defeat the Vulgus. If we cannot stop the invasion of Ingress by the Colossi, there will be no hope for humanity. Remember your calling. I will focus more attention on monitoring the Void Dimension. That was a job well done, Descendant. While you were intercepting the Colossus, the Guide gave Enzo some important intel. It concerns the next operation, so head back to HQ once you're ready. The success of this operation will lead us to victory. Descendant, using the Ancestor's data, the Guide claims to have discovered a zone where an Ironheart has been excavated. After undergoing emergency restoration protocols at that location, the Guide should be able to track the Ironheart. The problem is, the Ironheart excavation site is near a Vulgus munitions factory. It's a weapons production site where Cyborg Vulgus, the Legion of Immortality, are manufactured. Sharon and the Colon Special Forces along with Jeremy have been deployed there as the front line, and a bridgehead has been secured. I've assigned you to this operation as well. Sharon has exceptional infiltration skills, but I need someone who can lead the battle. Your mission is to infiltrate the Ironheart excavation site and restore the Guide's system. I still have my doubts about the Guide. Even for this operation, I'm sending you into the Lion's Den on the strength of her words. But after witnessing the intercept battle, I've made up my mind. We must find the Ironheart and close the Dimensional Wall as soon as possible. Failure to do so would leave the remnants of humankind to be trampled by the Colossi, even if we win the war against the Vulgus. So, I have decided to put my trust in the strategic value of the Guide. For now. Descendant, I leave this operation in your hands. The fate of humanity rests on your shoulders.
Humanity is very weak. That's why humans need us so desperately. Welcome to the Marshall's Lab.
I'll listen to what you have to say. You're here. Welcome to the Vulgus Munitions Factory. You've made quite the impression at Kingston. So much so, I was tempted to recruit you for Colon. But then again, the enemy isn't exactly a pushover. However, now that we have the Guide as a strategic asset, I'm sure the trajectory of this war will change drastically. Shall we get started? Based on the coordinates provided by the Guide, the Ironheart excavation site is near the enemy's industrial zone. Unfortunately, the exact location needs to be confirmed in person. The coordinates are based on data from the time of the ancestors, and there's a high probability that the topography today will look a little different. I'll do recon around the industrial zone. While I'm doing that, your mission is to create a diversion to draw the enemy's eyes away from me. Even though I have active camouflage, things will be much easier if you can hold the enemy's attention. I'll tell Jeremy to stay behind and provide operational support. Jeremy seems to be unable to link with the guide, so he won't be much use in finding the excavation site. He'll be better deployed using his RK teleportation abilities as support for your diversion operation. Let's get moving. We need to restore the guide system as soon as possible. What, me? Support? Oh, for crying out loud. Get to the point. Guide, guide, guide. That's all everybody talks about these days. Since when did the higher ups at Albion conduct operations based on the word of a spirit? Not to mention, excluding an excellent descendant like myself from this operation, everything's clearly going very well. Hey, you think it's funny I can't link with the guide? All right then, let's consider which descendants aren't able to link with the guide right now. Let's see. It's only me and Alpha, yes? Looks to me like the commander of Albion and the strongest descendant are the only ones who are still sane. If I were you, I'd think carefully about why you've been designated as a bait. And I'm going to do things my way. Don't even think about tagging along. Huh. Do you really think you can even attempt to follow me? With my RK abilities? <laughs> You've been ambushed, or did you let it happen? As a bank, it worked well, but you mustn't let your guard down. Those Volga cyborgs have had quite a few upgrades recently. You may suddenly encounter powerful units that aren't in our database. Closing in. We confirm it's a new Kyber enhanced variant. Huh. It's built with the same material as 
the one we're after. Make a note in the operations log, number 17. Thanks to the enemies being drawn your way, infiltration is going smoothly. Good job. I'm loading. Transmitter at the Vulgus base is operational. Descendant, you need to protect the transmitter while it is operating. If the diversion works, we can detain a number of enemies here.
mission request from Kolon Special Forces Agent Number 17. Objective: Secure a Volga sample. We need a Volga sample to study the recent technological improvements to Legion of Immortality units. This mission is also part of the diversion tactics.
Receiving info on March. Position of Volga's power plant confirmed. Mission request. Destruction of generators as a faint attack. Captain Harris let you in on a fun trick. Certain legion of immortality units have parts that can act as fuses. We can use those.
carrying huge parts confirmed. Start to head to the mining outpost. Do you have something to tell me? Descendant, we have an urgent report on Sharon. Her current position is near the Volgus Munitions Factory. Thanks to her diversionary tactics, she was able to... Re this is the sit rep recorded... Operating object tracking measures. Cyber retrospective active camouflage detected. Probability of zone infiltration high. Iron heart excavation site status. Quarantine at the highest level of security. Terminate the descendant on site. Terminate. Terminate. This cyborg Volgus, Edelic is a commando level model specializing in defense missions. It's armed with arcade tracking functions. And it seems the Volgas already know about the Arnhardt excavation site. I was told that the ancestors' data was tightly guarded at Kingston. If the Volgas have gained access to it, however, then this rigorous level of security makes sense. For the moment, Sharon has requested an attack on the repository's core facility to lure the Volgas commander. Once the Volgus have vacated the factory, she intends to try and infiltrate it again. Descendant, you and Jeremy are to launch an attack on the repository. Are you sure this guide can be trusted? Didn't you guys win at Kingston? <laughs> Focus on the mission, Jeremy. Descendant. I am at a loss for words. The Ancestor's data that the Vulgus obtained in Kingston was formatted in such a way that it could not be fully viewed until all of the data packets were combined. The Vulgus managed to transmit around 90% of the data. Defeating their commander prevented them from transmitting the remaining 10%. But they were able to reconstruct the missing 10% themselves and read all of the data. How was that? Possible. I need to analyze this. Descendant, you need to continue your search for the Arnhardt excavation site. 
If the Vulgus enter it first, they may destroy the entire site after they find what they want. We must hurry. How pathetic. A full operation for such a minor target? Guess the Colon Special Forces aren't that special after all. I've sent you a more appropriate mark, so you can show me what you can really do with those highfalutin skills of yours. Get it together, come on! Thank <laughs> you. 